So here we are in the embedded WFX power pack list. Now we have a small handful of power pack scripts that allow us to move one or multiple lists anywhere we want in Workflowy. As easy as WFX makes it for us to jump anywhere in our account at will is as easy as it is to move any lists anywhere at the drop of a hat. There are a range of pretty incredible options at our disposal. We're going to begin with the counterpart of WFX's ability to jump to any specific list. And we'll see how with the move to bullet script, we now have the power to move our lists to any specific destination we have in mind. It's pinpointed, it's precise, and it's brilliant. Let's go and find a list that I actually want to move stuff to. Here on my homepage, I've set up a list with a trash can icon. I want to be able to move stuff here that I'm not quite sure I want to outright delete. So let's zoom in here. Now, if we look at the URL up in the address bar, you'll see that each workflowy list ends with a 12 character ID. We need this ID before we set up a move to bullet shortcut. So we can manually select and copy. So double click and then control C. So now that I've copied my 12 character ID from the destination list where I want to move lists to, I'm going to head on over to the move to bullet script in the embedded power pack list. Activate WFX, WFM, and let me zoom into move to bullet. Having zoomed into my script, I activate WFX and use the built-in shortcut maker WFS. And now I just simply follow the setup instructions for this particular script. So the name for my target bullet is going to be trash, 12 character ID, paste that in. True, I want items moved to the top of the list. The number of seconds before the confirmation message hides, it gives you a default of three. I'm going to set it at five. Enter. And finally, my shortcut name will be TR to activate the script. Okay, so let's take this particular move to bullet script for a test drive now. I'm going to jump to my Kanban calendar, KB. And here at the top, you'll see I have some fish skeletons I want to move to the trash. So I place my cursor in the list, activate WFX, and hit my shortcut. So I'm going to move these to the trash. Enter disappears. And I'm going to follow this link to the trash. Let me now demonstrate how I can move this item around super quick from one list to another. So I've decided I want to use these fish skeletons to make some fish bone broth. And now I'm going to take this out of the trash. I'm going to send it to a list I've called one one. I don't have to follow, but in this case, I'm going to follow. Let me zoom out for a little context. Let me expand here. This is my Kanban schedule. Now I'm going to drag this task into my schedule at one o'clock. Now, later, once I'm done making fish bone broth, I'm going to move this to my done list. So let's activate WFX. And my shortcut for my done list is DD. I'm not going to jump there, but let me just expand here. And you'll see it there right at the top. The great thing is that you can set up as many or as few of these move to bullet shortcuts as you want. Now, let me show you how to send something to your home screen. So I'm going to jump to my move to bullet script. Activate my shortcut maker, WFS. And I'm going to type in home, enter. And all we do here is leave this entry field blank. We're not going to paste anything in there. We just hit enter. I'm going to type in false, actually, because I want to move items to the bottom of my home screen. Hit enter. 
let's give it five seconds. So my shortcut is going to be HH. And let's save it. Let's backtrack to where I was. And let me send this item to my home screen, HH. I'm going to follow this link in the banner. And there you see it at the bottom of my home screen. All right, so let me give you one more move to bullet tip for this screencast. Let's say you're working somewhere in Workflowy. And so I'm busy writing a story. Let me zoom in here. It was a dark and stormy night. Then I suddenly remembered that I need to buy a new umbrella. So here, where I am, without navigating anywhere, I just create a task. So And without going anywhere, I'm just going to send this to my task list. So one, one, and this time I'm not going to follow the link in the banner message. Now, this way I get to record a task and stay focused right here where I am. If you want, you can also create a move to bullet shortcut for your inbox, if you have one, where you'll get around to processing your to-dos at a later time. There's a whole lot more coming on moving stuff around using WFX. So on to the next screencast, and you'll find a link to that in the description box below the video.